Hello, everybody. I am Eric DeVolt from thephysedcoach.com. I am so glad that you're coming back to watch the fourth installment of our Google Classroom series. I'm excited to share this with you. Today, we're going to be talking about the grade page. Now, when you go to your grade page initially, it will be a blank screen. Nothing will be there. You have to have a roster, a list of students, and you also have to have a list of assignments. So you can see here that I have one student in the class and I made up several um, fake assignments so you can see what it looks like. But there are some settings that you can go to right over here in the settings cog. Just click on that, scroll down to where it talks about grading. You see uh, different options here. You can have no overall grading, total points are weighted by category. And then you can type in your categories. You can see here I've already typed in two categories for you. I like to use my learning targets as my categories instead of the, the traditional um, test and quizzes and participation. I want everything to be related to my learning targets and including the grading categories. So that's where you set your grade book up. And then when you go to make an assignment in the classwork page, which we'll get to in another video, when you create your assignments, let me edit this one real quick, you can add a grade category right here. Let's save that for now. And then whenever you go to give a grade, it will be in that category and whatever percentage you have for that grade category, it will be calculated automatically in the gradebook once the grade is entered. I hope that helps you uh, with the gradebook page in Google Classroom. If you enjoyed this video, please give me a big thumbs up. If you have questions about the, the grade uh, view, make sure you add a comment below and then share this with a colleague and let them know exactly how to add grades and set up the settings in Google Classroom. Hope to see you in the next video. Bye-bye.